Hello friends, I am Dr. Vijaya Nayak, working for Manipal Hospital at Delhi as Chief Gynec Consultant and my area of work is gynecological endoscopic surgery and robotic surgery. Endoscopic and robotic surgery means we deal with laparoscope, hysteroscope and robotic. The hospital does have a very good robotic uh, Gadgets that is the best in the world now that is uh, Davanchi XI and it's a new uh, perhaps it is uh, perhaps it is the most advanced instrument that this hospital possesses and we work with it. Yes, let us come to our topic dealing with uh, ovarian carcinoma and treating with uh, laparoscope and robotics in both the ways. Yes, it's uh, very important that ovarian cancer carcinoma means it is the cancer of ovaries. We have two ovaries on both the sides of our pelvis. They are attached to uterus and fallopian tubes. But the main scenario in this disease is the, usually the patient comes very late to us. In the very early stage, it is very difficult to diagnose ovarian carcinoma. So whenever the patient comes to us, either she comes to us in stage 3 or stage 4. But there are some uh, tumor markers. If you have your, uh, uh, that is, there is uh, any death or any, any, um, any cancer related things that has happened to your uh, family, any, any close relation of yours. So, you must be apprehensive of you suffering from carcinoma. So, one should do at least once or twice a ultra, just an ultrasound to know the architectural um, view of the ovaries and if you can do a certain kind of uh, tumor markers that and very essentially CA125 and CA19.9 or CEA, then almost uh, almost 90% uh, of uh, your ovarian carcinoma can be diagnosed very early. If you come very early to to a hospital or to the doctor who deals with that, they can uh, you can be cured of 100%. Okay, let us talk on how we deal with robotics now. Our hospital has got the best robotic one, and yes. Though the, the traditional opening uh, the uh, traditional opening of the abdomen and doing the surgery has been a has been a age old practice, still then robotics is considered nowadays one of the gold standard to diagnose the disease and to, to surgically uh, to know how far it has been extended. So with the with the robotics, we do first we go into the abdominal cavity to see the ovaries, how far, how far it has been um, affected by the cancers. What is the? Uh, it is always always to better to see rather than uh, better see through the different modalities of uh, radio radiological modalities. So once you see a thing that is one thousand percent. Uh, better, 1000 percent better, you can assess macroscopically what is, what is the configuration of the ovary. Does it have some kind of solid mass or cystic mass? Or does it has some kind of vascular um, activities, more of vascular activities uh, um, or it is attached to any kind of um, yes, um, solid organs um, like bowel, ureter, uh, uterus, or bladder it has been affected to these uh, these uh, organs of the body pelvis or it has been um, metastatized to different different parts of the body that even includes the diaphragm which is situated very high yes after seeing the uh, tumors one can go with the surgeries and surgery will be very precise and um, friends i am going to tell you surgery with robotics is very precise you can go millimeter wise and uh, even if the 
it is attached to the various uh, organs of the body it can be dealt with very nicely you can remove the ovary and you can remove the tubes you can remove the uterus if pel- all the pelvic lymph nodes that that can be uh, removed uh, even the uh, appendix uh, then omentum then paraiotic lymph nodes all things can be done with robotics and much better way and much precise way uh, than even opening up the case or even with laparoscope so friends uh, i think robotic has got the best chance and perhaps it is the gold standard to deal with with uh, ovarian carcinoma in early stages of ovarian carcinoma in very late stages as we are doing here in this hospital and we ha- i have been doing uh, many surgeries with uh, robotics uh, let it be uh, removing the uterus remo- removing endometriosis uh, lesions removing o- ovaries uh, etc and uh, but it is quite challenging to deal with ovarian carcinoma with robotics recently i have uh, encountered one patient from international patient from ethiopia she was diagnosed there uh, as a benign disease whenever she came here it 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 came out to be a malignant one and we dealt with uh, with uh, robotics and the patient went home after two days after the 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 most essential part in robotics is even if we do a very be, um, extensive surgery the patient can go back home within 48 hours within 48 hours maximum at the last time i must say you that friends we are a very highly uh, knowledgeable group in manipal hospital delhi we deal with all kinds of surgeries in gynecology uh, with robotics and uh, uh, laparoscope if you have got any queries you can call me directly and you can go to our website manipal group of website and you can jot down the email and the phone number there any without any hesitation any time you can call me no problem